13 is on your side. A West Michigan animal shelter is closed temporarily due to an outbreak of parvovirus. Harbor Humane was closed all weekend as well as today after diagnosing several dogs with the common yet potentially serious condition. 13 on your side's Charlie Tinker has been following in this forest. He joins us now. And Charlie, how many animals have tested positive? Well, Kirk, seven in total, which includes puppies and two adult dogs as well. They told me shelter staff got them into quarantine. The good news is they are expecting all of those animals to make a full recovery, and they are anticipating reopening tomorrow. Now, the flip side of this, you'll remember Harbor Humane was one of the shelters that took on dogs. Investigators seized from that animal rescue in Norton Shores, Cobra's Canines which authorities say kept them in deplorable conditions. They tell me that effort drained uh, much of their cash reserves, which meant finding the resources to deal with these new issues was a significant hurdle. It's just been wonderful for us to get the support that we have from our community. Uh, we, you know, we put a post up, we put an ask out for help, and our community just always steps up. And so, you know, we've raised now over $4,000 to help us care for not only these dogs, and then just the day-to-day -day care um, right after that, that Cobra's situation for months. So we're grateful. Now, the Michigan Ag Department says Parvo is a highly contagious virus that mainly affects dogs through contact with infected waste. Here is what they recommend. We get, we, we hear cases every year. Number one thing is vaccination, vaccination, vaccination. Get those routine vaccines on board. And then ideally this will prevent any kind of potential situations for dog to dog transmission, especially in those areas where dogs congregate such as shelters. And that's just because of how uh, common this is. There is no cure. Vets more or less manage the symptoms until the animal responds. Why keeping to that annual vaccine schedule is so important, along with other vet recommended preventative steps like having puppies fully vaccinated before allowing them to interact, keeping them at home if they're showing any signs and yet yeah, cleaning up after your pets while you're walking them, especially in public. Harbor Humane again expecting a full recovery in this case because of what's entailed in treating Parvo. However, they are asking folks to donate paper towels, blankets and towels to help out. Also encouraging anyone considering adopting to check them out for Empty the Shelter tomorrow and to learn more about that national event. Kirk, we've got the info up on 13onyourside.com right now. All right, Charlie, thank you.